I'm running out of time, Elizabeth. The land is dying. People are suffering. Soon, they'll starve. All because of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I can fix it. Only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. And then... Extinction. I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia. The AI you designed to control the system. I'm walking under a brilliant night sky, through a field of flowers. And when I arrive at the center, I see you, Elizabeth. Waiting for me, even though you've been dead for a thousand years. You're the closest person I've ever had to a mother. For a moment, I feel whole. But it never lasts. left alone. This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. Varl? <laughs> if it isn't Aloy, the savior of Meridian, anointed of the Nora. You know I hate being called that stuff. Well... Consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. Yeah. But that one was in your honor. Just saying. So! What are we doing? Must be urgent since you left so fast. Delving into ancient ruins? Or maybe it has something to do with the Blight. Both, actually, but, um... I, I should... Oh, no. I've been tracking you a long way. It's okay. After everything you've done to help the Nora and my family, I swore an oath to help you, no matter what. But you're stuck with me now. Like bark on wood. Okay, but if you're going to come with me, you'll need to be able to see what I see. <sighs> A focus? Never thought I'd get your second sight. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information on the device. We've got a lot to cover. 
Um, I'll have to explain everything as we go. You see like this all the time? Since I was a little girl. Come on. Shall we? <laughs> All right, I got a couple of scrapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants, stock up. So it's time for your first lesson with the focus. Sounds good. Let's get started. Bitter? No, at least they make you feel better. All right, we should keep going. Might want to grab more of these plants along the way. Yeah, good idea. Looks like the blight spread here, too. Those ruins, that's where we need to go. I see a few ways down. What are we after, exactly? The backup? Well, um... It's an AI. It's, um... It's hard to explain. Think of it like... A set of instructions that can fix the world. Sounds complicated. <laughs> yeah, I, um... Ran into some trouble on the way here. Lost a lot of my gear. And there they go. Looks like they left a carcass behind. A lot of arrows in that machine. Better take a closer look. took down this machine recently. Who else would come here? I don't know. But good thing we have some arrows of our own. Might be trouble about it. After you. <laughs> By the goddess. What was this place? I don't know. The transmission... The, uh, message I found didn't say. Only the backup might be here. We need to find a way in. So, um... What happened after I left Meridian? Well... Another one's coming. Someone shot this machine, too. So, after the fuss over me leaving, what did everyone else do? Well, as soon as the celebration was over, my mother led the rest of the Nora home. Sun King put his people to work rebuilding the city, and I set out to find you. 
Another ladder. Get a shoe off the lock. Yeah, found my first one when I fell into a ruin. Got the others from an old cache not long ago. That's good to have extras. Welcome to the Far Zenith launch facility. Far Zenith? I, I know they made some tech trades with Zero Dawn, but why would they have a backup of Gaia? Please register with reception for the tour. I guess they want us to check in with them? Please hold for identity scan. Access denied. Please wait here for personnel to assist you. Dr. Sobek. Okay. I guess they weren't on great terms with Elizabeth. Well, let's find a way in. I should be able to pry this open. There's climbing gear. Guess someone dropped in from above. Ugh. What's that stench? Entire camp. I doubt. They must have come here to delve for scrap. Acid. That explains the smell. And it looks like something big came in from above. Crash right through the camp. Not through the wall. I should take a look at the rubble in that gap. Whatever came through here brought this down as it went out. If I can dislodge some of the debris, we might be able to squeeze through. Maybe I can find something to help in the camp. Aloy, over here. I think I got something. It's some kind of Osram prototype, I think. This hook looks like it can latch onto things. And this gear pulls it back. Hmm. It looks broken, but maybe we can repair it. Hook it to the debris. And pull it out. That could work. The focus can help us search the camp and identify anything we can use to fix the tool. My focus picked up a couple of things to check out. Poor guy. Acid burned right through his armor. Part of a machine. Could help fix the gears. <clears throat> Machine cable. Stronger than rope. All right, I think I have what I need to repair the tool. Or maybe even make something better. You could use this workbench. There. Uh, pole caster. Now to test it on the debris. Got it. That worked better than I thought. What's this? Oh, I might be able to get up there. Wow, that works. That pull cast is useful. Too bad there's only one. Don't worry, I'll find you another way up. I think I can turn this thing on. Okay, there you go, girl. Thanks. sapiens us we have always pushed the boundary as explorers pioneers trailblazers and now far zenith is taking the next leap into the future that's why we're proud to have resurrected the odyssey 
When our government's abandoned in orbit, Far Zenith will actualize in less than a decade. But that's only the beginning. When the ship is complete, we will send the Odyssey and her crew where no one's gone before. The serious system. There we'll create humanity's first off-world colony. The Odyssey may take 300 years to reach it. But when we look up at the night sky, we'll know they're on their way. And in the words of our founder, the late Peter Chinvumbe, the true storm of immortality is data corrupt. The playback stopped. The old ones could fly through the sky? Between the stars? Uh, well, yes, sort of. That ship, the Odyssey, it, it never made it to the other star. Something went wrong, and it blew up. Is that why Elizabeth gave them a backup of Gaia? For a colony? Public presentation file corrupted. Member recruitment file available. Do you wish to reactivate? Yeah, reactivate. Let's see what else they had to say. We all know the projections. Economic instability, new biocontagions, rampant AIs. How long before another catastrophe creates unacceptable risk for the world's elite? We here at Far Zenith believe, escape the inevitable. And so we reach for the stars. Now you've seen what we're building here. Infrastructure to support the Odyssey's construction. A state-of-the-art data center to facilitate rapid technological advancements. And you've seen how we're managing public perception. So invest and join us. Claim your birth on the Odyssey. Preserve your way of life beyond the concerns of Earth. Well, they were right about the world ending. I just didn't know how yet. So everything they said back there about the next step for humanity, it was all a lie. These people only cared about saving their own skin. Yeah, well, didn't work out for them in the end. That Oswald guy mentioned a data center. There, the backup. It should be stored in there. Won't be able to swim across. I guess we'll have to find a way around. Come on. The wilds have really grown over this place. Thanks to calling some friends from underground. You take the left one. I'll deal with the one on the right. Okay. Moving off. I need to sneak up on it to take it out with my spear. Can't let it see me. I should scan it first. Check its patrol path. I need 
need to sneak up on it to take it out with my spear. Can't let it see me. I should scan it first. Check its patrol path. Sneak up on it to take it out with my spear. Can't let it see me. I should scan it first. Check its patrol path. I can throw a rock to distract it. Put it into a position where I can sneak up and strike. Just have to wait for the right moment. Mine's down too. More of those machines ahead. Definitely not okay, Vanna. I've been meaning to mention. I noticed you have a new look these days. <laughs> yeah, I know. Didn't have a lot of time to shave when I was trying to catch up to you. Don't worry, it's not permanent. The Osra must have used explosives against the machines. They managed to get a couple. Careful, traps ahead. Huh. Might be able to just there. Managed to save some supplies. Yeah, that hurt. The main solution. look these days? Yeah, I know. Didn't have a lot of time to shave when I was trying to catch up to you. Don't worry, it's not permanent. We're clear. Let's keep going then. data mentions the tech that Farzine infiltrated with Zero Dawn, but it doesn't explain how they got it back up. I'll keep an eye out for more data. Well, it is a thousand years old. Looks like some kind of meeting room. Onzu. The Zero Dawn terraforming system, the brainchild of Dr. Elizabeth Sobek, empowered by nine subordinate functions, Gaia, the core of the system, is capable of advanced planetary engineering. 
An obvious advantage to our space colonization efforts. Operation Phase 1. Establish an asset within Project Zero Dawn. Status complete. Phase 2. The asset will secretly beamcast a complete copy of Gaia and her subordinate functions to this facility's data center. If all goes well, Zero Dawn staff will remain completely unaware of the transmission. Risks. Discovery of this operation could result in Zero Dawn withholding the already negotiated Apollo database. Special care must be taken not to alert Travis Tate, the expert hacker in charge of Hades Protocol. In addition, extreme caution must be exercised in regards to Dr. Sobek herself. As one of the world's preeminent technologists, she may have instituted unforeseen security measures. A complete assessment is attached. This concludes the executive summary. I thought Elizabeth sent the backup here, but she didn't. Far Zenith stole Gaia. Aloy, why does that woman look like you? Uh, um, it's okay, Paul. We look alike because we're the exact same, genetically identical. But she was one of the old ones. How can you be her? Because I wasn't born. I was made. By a machine. It's why I'm motherless, why I was cast out as an infant. I don't understand. What kind of machine can make a person? Remember when I said the backup is like a set of instructions? It's... More than that, it's called Gaia. And for a long time, she cared for the world until she had to destroy herself. So she made me to bring her back. I'm the only one who can. And this place is my last hope. You once said the goddess spoke to you when you went into All Mother Mountain. Was that this? Gaia? Yes, but she's not the goddess, Laurel. There isn't one. How can you be sure? It sounds like she anointed you with a sacred task. <sighs> I've had a lot of... Huh. Look at that. Aloy, over here. I found something you could use. A weapon. Thanks, Merle. We should keep moving. After you. Down here. I think we're almost back outside. Good. We're going. Right. Oh, machines. Look at your weapon on it. Looks like we can cross over here. So, the backup is the last. Point. Yeah. All those places I've been these last few months. There were supposed to be more backups. But a thousand years ago, a guy named Ted Farrow approached them all. Was he part of our team too? No. He was worse. We can tag them in a focus to keep track of them. Okay, now how to get out of here? There's a ladder in the back.
So tell me something. Sona was really okay with you not going back to the Sacred Lands? As the Nora War Chief, she understood why I was obligated to follow you. But as my mother, she wasn't pleased. Is she ever pleased? I don't think I've seen her smile. Me neither. <laughs> Just need a cut. Maybe I should stick to my spear for now. Save some ammo. if I launch myself off that grapple point. Looks like there are massive clamps holding the shuttle in place. I'll bet there's a control console nearby. If I can release the clamps, the shuttle should fall. <laughs> control console might be in there. Okay. Time to crush those machines down below. the other connector.
Finally. Once I get the backup, I can reboot Gaia, fix the system, heal the Blight, restore Elizabeth's dream. But is it still there? <laughs> 